All right, let's go from Henderson to, well, right down the street. We're talking about renovations at the iconic Circus Circus. Yes, this morning we've got a sneak peek at what's already been done. Maybe you've noticed what's to come. Candace has that sneak peek. She's joining us live this morning. Good morning. Good morning, you too. Good morning, folks. Yeah, you may have noticed the construction going on in and around the family-friendly hotel and casino. As you can see, the new tent up is in tip-top shape inside there's some new additions and a nice little surprise take a look we are really trying to focus in on making the guest experience for kids families that much better oh the family friendly circus circus hotel and casino is getting a facelift new owner phil ruffins has been on a quest to bring the hotel casino back to its heyday since he took ownership in 2019. he came in and he saw what a real jewel that this is. The garage with all the bells and whistles. I think I ran into something already. <laughs> was put in. The Midway got upgrades and its newest addition acts it up. Take one step and throw. Gives families the chance to try. <laughs> ah. And try again. Oh. Your hand at axe throwing. Okay, that's a wrap on that one. <laughs> and there are more surprises. We haven't shown this to anybody. You get a first peek through here. So this is going to be a SpongeBob ride. The only one of its kind on the West Coast, set to open in December. So far, $25 million has gone into renovations, but the biggest price tag. This will be their first one that guests are gonna be able to ride in. The elevators, sitting at a whopping $12 million. Whether it's night or day, you're bound to notice the changes. The most notable, the iconic tent top. Doesn't it look beautiful? Now that took a little over three months and a little over a million dollars. If you're wondering about all the construction that was going on, that likely was it. Work is continuing. All projects are expected to be done by the end of next year. Those elevators, uh, that'll be 2025. Of course, you can stick with us for the latest on these renovations. We'll have all details for you on the website, 8newsnow.com. For now, live outside of the hotel and casino, Circus Circus, I'm Candace Charles, 8 News Now. I think it's like, you know, because Circus Circus has been there since 68. Mm -hmm. You've got the Fountain Blue about to open. You had Resorts World brand new. They had to up their game a yeah, little. Yeah, they got to clean up the house a little bit. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, Candace, got to work on the uh, axe throwing just a little. Yeah, thanks, Candace. <laughs>